Let's analyze a four-bar mechanism to find the angular velocity of link AB. Here's a diagram showing the mechanism. Link AD is the fixed ground link. We have three moving links, AB, BC, and CD. Initially, link AB makes a 30 degrees angle with the horizontal. Link BC makes a 60 degrees angle with the horizontal. Link CD makes a 120 degrees angle with the horizontal. The lengths of the links are AB equals 25 centimeters, BC equals 60 centimeters, CD equals 40 centimeters, AD equals 70 centimeters, and omega underscore CD, angular velocity of CD, equals five radian per second counterclockwise. We'll use the relative velocity method. The velocity of point C is the vector sum of the velocity of point B and the velocity of C relative to B. This can be expressed as V underscore C equals V underscore B plus V underscore C slash B. Let's visualize these velocities. The velocity of point C V underscore C is perpendicular to CD and is found using V underscore C equals omega underscore CD asterisk CD. V underscore C equals five radian per second asterisk 40 centimeters equals 200 centimeters per second. The velocity of B V underscore B is perpendicular to AB and V underscore C slash B is perpendicular to BC. We can solve using the velocity triangle. Let's draw the velocity triangle. Using the law of sines on the velocity triangle, V underscore B slash sin 120 degrees equals V underscore C slash sin 60 degrees. Since V underscore C equals 200 centimeters per second, we can solve for V underscore B. V underscore B is almost equal to 120 centimeters per second then. Omega underscore B equals V underscore B slash B. Omega underscore B equals 120 centimeters per second slash 25 centimeters is almost equal to 4.8 radians per second. Therefore, the angular velocity of link AB is approximately 4.8 radians per second. From the velocity triangle, we can see that the direction is counterclockwise.